Come on, how's everybody today? You ready to praise God? Vamos, listos para adorar a Dios? Come on in. We're going to get started. I want to give a, a, a little bit of instruction this morning. Vamos, pasen. Quiero dar un poco de instrucción esta mañana. Today uh, we are having obviously a water baptism service. Hoy obviamente vamos a tener bautizos. And the power of God is already here. Y el poder de Dios ya está aquí. Come on, somebody say amen. The power of God's amen. already here. Dios ya está aquí. Uh, now, here's how we want to do this. As you see, our little ones, we like them to be in the presence of God. Como ven los chiquitos, nos gusta que estén en la presencia de Dios. But sometimes it's like herding cats. Pero muchas veces es como tratar de agarrar gatos. I mean, you know, cats don't herd very well. Como saben, los gatos no no se llegan muy pronto. So we're going to need your help today. Así que vamos a necesitar su ayuda hoy. Uh, there is not, there is no um, uh, child care today. Ahora no hay cuidado de niños. And later on during our offering march and during announcements, we're going to uh, ask for some volunteers for children's help. Y después de que haya, uh, recibamos la ofrenda, vamos a pedir That's ayuda when everybody para claps right there. Ahí es cuando todos aplauden. Whitney Foch is helping me uh, direct that. Uh, la hermana Whitney es, nos va a ayudar a dirigir eso. And since we've been, uh, the church has become essential, come on somebody. Y uh, ya que la iglesia se, es esencial, vamos a alguien. We still have a lot, uh, a lot of folks, um, probably about 60% of our folks have not come back and so therefore we've had a struggle getting volunteers for child care. Y tenemos como el 60% de las personas que todavía no regresa, así que hemos estado batallando un poco para tener voluntarios para los niños. So we need your help, amen? Así que necesitamos su ayuda, amen? All right, let's all stand up. Vamos todos de pie. Now, parents. Padres. All of your little ones and, and they love the flag and everything. Todos los chiquitos que les gusta con las banderas. That whole west side against the roll up doors right there. Todo ese lado a mi izquierda junto a las puertas. Is going to be designated for the kids. Va a estar designado para los niños. I'll give some more um, instructions and, and if they want to sit up front on this first line to watch the water baptism. Y si se quieren sentar aquí enfrente para que vean los bautizos. That's going to be perfectly fine, but what we're going to do is uh, crisscross applesauce, right, Trent? Y está bien, pero lo que vamos a hacer es crisscross applesauce que se sienten. And I'll pisados. give and I'll give more directions to that later. Y les voy a dar más instrucciones de eso en un, en un poco tiempo. Okay, amen. Amen. Vamos. Everybody good? Todos bien. We're going to um, worship a little bit. Vamos a adorar un poco. And set the atmosphere. Let's all lift your hands. Y... Hacer la atmósfera aquí. Levanten sus manos. Lord Jesus. Señor Jesús. Lord, we thank you that you always hear us when we pray. Te damos gracias que siempre nos escuchas cuando oramos. I thank you, Lord, that you're always in our midst when we gather in your name. Te doy gracias que tú siempre estás en medio cuando usamos tu nombre. And we honor you, Holy Spirit. We welcome you. Te honramos. Te... Bienvenido, Espíritu Santo. That you come and inhabit all our praise. Ven y está aquí en toda nuestra adoración. Holy Spirit, we give you honor and we give you all glory. Espíritu Santo, te damos todo honor y toda gloria. Come on, start just praising the whole. Don't even wait on the worship team. Just start praising. I praise you, Holy Spirit. Lord, I thank you, Holy Spirit. Te doy gracias, Espíritu Santo. We worship you today. Te adoramos hoy. We ask you in Jesus' name. Te pedimos esto en el nombre de Jesús. That your name would be lifted up. Que tu nombre sea levantado, sea That alzado. you would draw all men into yourself. Que traigas a todo hombre a ti. We commit this time and this service to, be, to you. Te dedicamos este tiempo de servicio a ti. Let your will be done on earth, right here in this building, right now. Que tu voluntad sea hecha aquí en la tierra, aquí en este edificio ahora. On earth as it is in heaven. En la tierra como es en el cielo. In Jesus name. En el nombre de Jesús. Everyone said y amen. Come on, amen. let's give the Lord a head shout. Let's worship and permeate the atmosphere. Let's worship the Lord. You can come up to the front and, and all over and we will we'll get back in just a little bit. Let's Vamos go, a adorar, worship team. A preparar la atmósfera. Los invitamos acá adelante. Out of the grave, breaking 
to the wild And don't be afraid So run into wide open spaces Graces waiting for you And it's like the weight has been lifted Graces waiting Where the Spirit of the Lord is There is freedom There is freedom Where the Spirit of the Lord is There is freedom There is freedom Come out of the dark Just as you are Into the fullness of it
has been lifted Grace is waiting for you And dance like the weight has been lifted Grace is waiting for you And dance like the weight has been lifted Grace is waiting to so dance like the weight has been lifted Grace is waiting so dance like the wind has been lifted Cause he did it, yes he did it So dance like the wind has been lifted Grace is waiting, yeah and Where the Spirit of the Lord is There is freedom, there is freedom Where the Spirit of the Lord is There is freedom, there is
until you're covered in life and the valley blooms like a rose but in the light yeah i hear the call to attention i feel the change in the air for the ground is dry but the clouds are overhead
Cause there's a key within your song So leave the past where it belongs, child And take a leap into the light And find the freedom you were born for And tell that soul to rise, arise Get up and I need to be obedient right now. If your name is John and you're in this room right now, the Lord has a word for you. I hear a second name, his name is Duncan. I do not know if your name is John Duncan or you are two individuals. But if your name is John or Duncan, raise your hand in this room right now. The Lord says, I have rolled away the stone for you. I have rolled away the stone and I have made a way. The Lord says, I have heard your cry in the hours of the early morning. You have cried to me, son. The Lord says, I come this day to deliver you to save you and set you into a brand new season. Come on, somebody. The Lord says, I watch what I will do. Watch what I will do. Hey, come on. Hey, Jesus. Come on, let's worship the King of Kings. Come alive, dry bones. Come alive, come alive, come alive, dry bones.
nothing but the blood of Jesus. What can make us whole again? Nothing but the blood of Jesus. The Lord has come into the service in a very significant way. We are not going to do church as usual. This is a very different sovereign time right now. Pastor Nita, get ready and get my first five up here. At the end of the service, we are going to come together and sow our tithes and our offerings and our seed. And we're going to come together as a family at the end. But I feel very strongly that the Lord wants to begin to minister very powerfully through the waters of baptism. Come on, somebody say amen. Now, kids, this is what I want to do is parents, help me. I don't want to get all the little ones. If they want to stay up here, that's perfectly fine, but I need them to sit down, down in front here. Whew. Yeah. Now, Jesus met John the Baptist at the River Jordan and was baptized. Jesus is our example of water baptism. Come on, somebody say amen. amen. He also commanded in Matthew 28, 19, he said, go make disciples, baptizing in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Now, we are gonna to begin to do this in just short fashion. We got five X's just stand right there. Just give me one at whatever you got. Get that microphone over there, Pastor. Follow my instructions, please. Give a hand for Nita. We have, uh, we have five names, Katie Johnson, Julio, Gar Julio Garcia, Julio, Chloe Rice, Chloe Rice, Kelly Garcia, Kelly Garcia, and Kaylee Rice, Katie Rice. They're here. No? Okay, give me the next four. All right, Delaney Foch. Delaney Foch. Come on, Delaney, right here, baby. Ann Law. Ann Law. Ann Kelly. Ann Kelly, is she here? And Caitlin Preciado. Woo, come on. What do you got? You got four? Uh, yeah, we have four. Let's go with those four right there. All right. Now, a lot happens in the water of baptism. Come on, somebody say amen. amen. The first thing that we shared last Wednesday was we become one with Christ. Just as Jesus was crucified, it says in Colossians that we are crucified with Christ through the waters of baptism. We become one with him. It literally means that we, in the water of baptism, that we put on Jesus Christ like a garment and he wraps himself around us. We become one. Come on, somebody say amen. With Christ. Another powerful thing that's going to happen to you is the circumcision of your heart. The old things and the old man is cut away supernaturally as we go under, as we are laid down, crucified with Christ, buried with Him in the water of baptism, and we are raised into the newness of life. Come on, somebody. How many of you are glad for the newness of life in Christ Jesus? Yeah. It is powerful. Jesus, when He went into the waters of Jordan with John, and John said, how can I baptize you? I can't even untie your sandals, but yet you want me to baptize you. Jesus said that we must do this to fulfill all righteousness. What Jesus was signifying and saying right there was I am the end of the Old Testament and I am the beginning of the new. Come on, somebody. And as he came out of the water, the heavens were opened up. And the, and the Holy Spirit descended out of heaven and rested on Jesus. The Holy Spirit in Acts 2, 38 says to be repent, to receive Jesus. 
to be baptized and then receive the Holy Spirit. Come on, somebody. Receive the Holy Spirit. What's going to happen to you is you open up your heart and allow the Holy Spirit to touch you when you come out of that water. You are coming into a season now of becoming one with Christ. And whatever rested on Jesus, is there any limit to his life? Now there's no limit to yours. Come on, somebody. Say, no living with no limits. All right, this is what we're going to do. Pastor Nita, start right here. And I want you to give us a testimony, a real short why are you being baptized today? Hold it up right up there to her. I chose to be baptized today because I realized that my life is nothing without the Lord. And that since I had the Lord come into my heart and I became a full, full on follow the Bible Christian, follow the Lord, that the doors have just been opened. Like come no on. Other. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Katie, tell us, why are you getting baptized today? I was baptized as a eight-year-old. But I've lived a lot and done a lot of bad things since then. And I have three children now. Yeah, come on. <laughs> one here, one in heaven, and one in my womb. And... I just want to get rid of every <laughs> torment of thought from Come my on. past and every hindrance that has been keeping me from my calling and keeping me from operating my gifts. And I just want the water that Jesus had that day. Yes. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Delaney, why are you getting baptized today? Because I love Jesus and it makes me feel welcome with him. Because I love Jesus and it makes me feel welcome with him. Because you love Jesus and it makes you feel welcome? Come on, somebody. I love to receive that. Right on, Delaney. Ann. Well, I was raised Lutheran, and it's kind of strict. When you're a teenager, you go through two years of instruction, and then you're questioned by the church, and you're accepted, and you accept the Lord. I did get away a little bit in college, but when I went back to church, I didn't go Lutheran, but I kept feeling like something was missing with my relationship with the Lord. And every time I heard the word baptism, I got this prod that I needed to be baptized. I really thought I had been as part of the process. I finally broke down and called the Lutheran church and they said, oh man, we only sprinkle, we don't baptize. And that's why I'm here today. I want to- Come on, in full immersion, yeah. Wow, all right. Here's how we're gonna do it. I would like you to go right over here. We're gonna start here. One, two, three, four. Go right over there with those gentlemen. They're gonna help you right over there. And Pastor Steve, let's stand your hand. Put your hand up, Pastor Steve. Now, this is a celebration. Come on, somebody. We're all part of it. Come on, we are celebrating with the brothers and sisters in Christ right now. We're gonna worship a little bit. And we're gonna baptize them, Pastor Steve and I, in the name of Jesus. Uh, I was gonna start, well, no, no, no. Your reverse order. Reverse order, follow my instructions, please. All right, Katie Johnson, come on up here. You can stand up and extend your hands and worship team. We're gonna have a wonderful time, just back us up. To do is come, come alive, forward right there alive, and sit down. Come, alive, come, alive, come, alive, come on, let's worship the Lord. Whoa, hey, hey. Come alive, come alive. Caitlin Bethany, come alive, because of the confession come alive, of your faith alive, and your desire to be one with Jesus, alive, we baptize alive, you now in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Come on, the Lord is ministering right now in Jesus' name. When she's ready, then we can get her out. Whoa. Come on, let's worship.
got that watch again. It's waterproof. Waterproof. Sit right up there. Kind of sit down on your rear. Without your knees. There you go. You want to readjust there? I'm going to sing There you go. There you go. Oh, Pastor Steve. Caitlin, because of your confession of faith, belief in the Lord Jesus Christ and your desire to be one with Him, we baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Fill her, Lord. Fill her, Lord. Fill her, Lord. Fill her, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Jesus' name. Yay, mama, 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 yay, yay, yay. Come alive, come alive, drive, oh, oh, yay, one with Christ, full of the Holy Ghost. belief in Jesus Christ and your desire to be one with him. We baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Patterson family here. I think they're going to wait. Patterson family, you guys are going to wait? Yeah, they're going to wait. They're going to wait? Okay, then we have Carson Quintana. Come on, Carson! Natalie Quintana. Sarah Ingram. Woo! Come on, Angel, Sarah! Angel Weger. And Cassidy Bowley. Cassidy Bowley! Come on! All right, I know what. We need to worship some more. Let's go. Come on, let's worship a little bit more. Come on, get your worship on. 
<laughs> I'm going to let you sit there in the presence of the Lord for just a moment. Pushing back when the darkest weapons form There's a power on my lips Even death can't defy When the name of our God is lifted high Cause there is resurrection power When we sing the name of Jesus Resurrection power Mighty sound, so come on, let the praise get loud. Let me get up to grave reason, cause it's resurrection power in his name. There are days I have seen full of heartache and loss that have buried my heart beneath. Pastor Nita, in your hands still. Pastor Steve just said, this is the next representation of the next five-fold ministry. Come on, somebody. Come on, I believe it. Oh, you can do better than that. Come on, they're coming up to, they are, they're gonna be earth shakers. Come on. Woo! Cassidy, why are you being baptized today? Whoa.
the last time that baptism came through the bridge, the Lord told me to get baptized and I didn't listen. I didn't obey God. I said, no God, I'm not gonna do that in front of everybody. <laughs> it's not happening. And I was praying the other night and he said, those chains that you have around your hands right now of abandonment and depression. <laughs> those can be broken in the water <laughs> tomorrow. Wow, come on. Come on, I want to go quick. Let's go quick. Come on, pastors. I'll be back. Come on. Come on. Let's stand your hands. Help her right now. Cassidy Bowledge, comes to your confession and believes in the Lord Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior and your desire to be baptized and to become one with Him. We baptize you in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Angel, why do you want to be baptized today? Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Lord of lords and King of kings. There's none like you, Lord. Come on, intercede. Let's pray. Intercede. So, um, I have been baptized before, and um, since then, um, I have made a lot of mistakes and um, sinned a lot. And I've had a really rough um, experience growing up in a come on yeah glorify him I felt like I don't know I was thinking today and I feel like that um, I'm just ready for the chains to be broken yeah you know, just come from on. everything come on Come on, let's baptize our pastors. Get ready.
why. Tell us why you're getting baptized today. Come on, extend your hand to Sarah. Um, I got baptized when I was nine. And since then, I've gone through a lot in my life. Um, I feel like a lot has happened in that time, and I just... I haven't felt this way with my relationship with God. And I was... I wasn't going to get baptized, but God kept telling me, you need this. Because I, I feel like I've needed that missing puzzle piece. And that will finish. Yeah, come on. So I just... That's why. Come on, yeah. No more missing pieces. Come on, somebody. Come on, Sarah. Did make a ladder like me, a ladder like me, when we say yeah. Whoa. your confession of faith and your belief in the Lord Jesus Christ and your desire to be one with Him. We baptize you now in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. <laughs> Yay! Woo! Now, we sing the name of Jesus. Natalie, come on, give a hand for Natalie. Natalie, why are you being baptized today? The Lord has told me to be baptized for a long time, but I put it off because I was afraid of what people think. I thought I was worthless. I thought I was nothing. But the Lord's taking me into a season where that fear needs to be stripped away. He's taking me into a season where I don't need to be afraid. Come on, yeah. Woo! <laughs> Yeah, thank you. Come on, extend your hands and pray. Carson, stay right there. Carson, why are you being baptized today? I've been, uh, I didn't understand why we were baptized. That's why I've put this off so long. Um, after meetings with Pastor Jim and Wednesday night service, I feel I have to. I cannot go any further in my relationship until I get baptized and... I just need my heart sanctified, and I do not want any limitations any longer. Come on, yeah, come on. Come on, Natalie. Come on, Carson. Let's go, worship team. Come on, extend your hands over here.
lifted your hands. Come on, praise Jesus. Come on. Miracles are happening right now. Deliverance is happening. Healing is happening in the hearts of God's children right now. He is making himself one with them. Come on, give the Lord a shout right now in Jesus' name. Pastor, get the next, give me the next list of five up here. Are you on? Francisco and Rosario Arias. Oh, come on, yeah. Frankie Bravo. Elvia Sotelo. And Scott on, McCoy. Frankie. Scott McCoy. Scott McCoy. Scott McCoy. Scott McCoy. My friend. Extend your hands to Carson. Come on, let's go. Is Elvia here? Mm. Elvia Sotelo. Carson, because of your commitment to Jesus Christ, your faith right now, your desire to walk with Him all the days of your life, your desire to be one with Him without limitation, we baptize you now in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Ghost. Whoa! Whoa. Sandra? Come on! Praise! Carry it with that. Come on and get you. Where's Brianna? It's Jesse Bri. and Brianna. Come on, Jesse and Bri. Come on up. Come and on, give him a Salvador hand. Salvador Pen. Salvador Pena. No. Wow. Oh, come on, somebody. This is powerful. Come on, people are getting set free in Jesus' name. Come on, somebody. Say, Lord, I thank you. You set me free in Jesus' name. Where is Pastor Erica? Come on. Pastor Nita, hold up the microphone. Brother, why are you getting baptized today? Yo hoy quiero bautizarme porque quiero entregarle mi vida a Dios. I want to baptize because I want to completely surrender my life to God. Para que me dé para que me dé el poder. So he can give me the power. Para vencer a Satanás. To overcome all the Satan's strategies. Y todos los espíritus que vengan a molestarme, a ponerme, and all the attacks, que me quieran llevar en contra de Dios, and everything that will try to make me or hold me back from God, y ser un servidor, and I want to be a servant, 100%, 100%, y en cada momento y a donde quiera, in all moments and everywhere I am, y cada lugar que pise, and every place I go, yo hable de él, I will speak of him. Yeah. Por lo que quiero a hoy bautizarme. I want to get baptized today because es por renovar votos. It's to renew my vows con el Señor. With the Lord. Cristo viene pronto. Christ is coming soon. 
quiero estar a tope con él. I want to be ready for this. Quiero que me encuentre haciendo su voluntad. I want him to find me doing his will. Come on. Quiero que me encuentre. I want him to find me predicando su palabra. Preaching his word. Siendo obediente. Being obedient. Sometida. Submitted. Come on. Y guardar su palabra. And to guard his word. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! Frankie, why are you getting baptized today? So, uh, can you hear me? All okay. the way up. Yeah. So, I said it this morning, but this past week when I was working, I was, I've been, this whole week, it's just been reading and praying, you know, really just the, the, one of the most impactful weeks of my life. So, when I was working, I, the Lord said, why? Whoa, wow. Why, why are you, why are you, why, why do you want this relationship with me? Wow, come on. And before it was for selfish desires and things that I wanted and things for the Lord to answer my prayers. And now, now it's just for that relationship. A lot has changed in my life. There has been a lot of mistrust and dishonesty and just a whole bunch of ups and downs, but but I can see it now. Come on, brother. Come on. <laughs> Jesse, why do you want to be baptized today? So, like my brother, we the stream that we were in before, it didn't quite make sense and I didn't understand and I, again, put it off for a while and the season I'm in now, I've carried the mantle of a husband over my household and I wow. need what's in the water yeah. in order to go forward, to lead my house. This is, in the, this is so much more than an outward expression of faith. I'll declare my faith every single day, but I need to step forward into a deeper relationship. I can't go forward unless this happens. And so wow. much more than just a, just a declaration. I love Jesus and I'll die for him, but I want the mantle. This has something to do about being high priests in the kingdom and I need that mantle to lead my house. Come on, yeah. Woo! Whew. Um, so I've been baptized before. Um, and like a month ago, um, Jesse asked me, he's like, why do you get baptized? And it was like, just because you do. Like, I just told him, like, you just get baptized. And, you know, like, that's just what you do. And he's like, no, but like, why do you get baptized? And it made me think like, I've been baptized, but I, I just grew up thinking that's just what you do. Like I'm a Christian and you get baptized. And so this past week, I've just been feeling a tug in my heart to come get baptized and pastor preached about it. And um, I just kept hearing the Lord say, you need to get baptized, you need to get baptized. On, and I was like, dude, on. I've already been baptized. I don't need to get baptized. And then, like, um, Jesse and his siblings were getting baptized. And I was like, you know what? Like, it is a time for new beginnings. And my past is my past. <laughs> and it's time to get baptized for a new beginning. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Scott, why do you want to be baptized today? So when the Level Up class came, um, I decided I wanted to go. Not really sure why, I felt like I needed to. So uh, as we were going through it, although I've been baptized two other times, I knew I needed to be baptized. So I put my name on the list. It doesn't make sense, but I knew I needed to, so that's why I'm doing it. Come on, somebody. We are made overcomers by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of our testimony. Come on, that's why we ask, why do you want to be baptized today? Let's go. Let's go that way. We're going to start right there. Pastor Erica, I need you and Pastor Pedro. There is no shadow. Come on, let's extend your hands. Let's worship. Come your light. There is no rival. Stand against your might. You've always been with us. Every battle you've already won. You 
for anyone to be one with him today we baptize you now in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit Show me one thing you can do. Show me a mountain you can move. He's the God of the Turn that song up. Everything Come on, possible. there's nothing you can't do, Lord. Come on. Show me one thing that's too hard. Show me what as he can't put. He's the God of the break. Everything is possible. It's possible. There is a kingdom that's advancing at the speed of light. And in his kingdom, every dead thing is bound to rise. Oh, God, our Redeemer. Is that it? He is faithful to restore. Oh, he will restore. Let's all stand up. Come on, let's all stand. Stand your hands. Show me a mountain in Cambu. He's the God of the breakthrough. And anything is possible. Show me one thing that's too hard. Show me what is he can't for. He's the God of the breakthrough. And anything is possible. Possible. Rosario, Rosario, put your hand right there, right on your nose. Because of your confession of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ and your desire to be found faithful at His return and your desire to be one with Him, we baptize you now. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Shake off this man as I sing out your name. A victory dance, I will dance out in faith. I will run this support and break every chain. Full of my fear, I will turn into praise. Shake off this man as I sing out your name. A victory dance, I will dance out in faith. I will crush this support. Show me what he can do. Show me a mountain he can do. He's the God of the breakthrough, and anything is possible. Show me one thing that's too hard. Show me what is he can do. He's the God of the breakthrough, and anything is possible. It's possible. Thank you. Put your hand right on your on your nose. There you go. Put your hand right there. Show me one thing you can do. Show me a mountain you can do. He's the God of the breakthrough, and anything is possible. Show me one thing that's too hard. Show me what else you can do. He's the God of the breakthrough, and anything is possible. Show me one thing you can do. Show me nothing you can do. He's the God of the breakthrough. 
Jesse. Grab your notes. Put your other hand right here. Jesse, because of your desire, your confession of faith, and your desire to serve the Lord God wholeheartedly and to lead your family, Father, your desire to be one with Him. We baptize you now in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> yeah. Yay! Oh, thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Yeah. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. A victory dance. I will dance out of faith. We're going to disappoint me. Show me what I'm going to do. Get to hear what I'm going to do. I need help. He can't get out by himself. Hold on. He's a God. Oh, God. He's a God. He's a God. Anything's possible. Yeah, God. Show me what I'm going to do.
Listen. We've already had one. Somebody wants to get baptized. If you weren't on the list, you want to be baptized right now. Come right on up here. We've already had one. Come on, somebody. If it's God is touching your heart, come right on up. Come on, let's hear it for Courtney right now. Plus. Oh, Hannah. Oh, Stephanie. Oh, Jordan. Come on. Woo! Wow. All right. Courtney, I want you to testify what's happening in your heart right now that causes you want to be baptized today. Um, about a, like two weeks ago during prayer, I kept hearing in the spirit, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wow. And I didn't know what it meant, so I went to Pastor Jim and I said, I just keep feeling like I just hear these words, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And he said, go home and pray about it and figure out what God wants you to do with it. And as I was sitting over there and like praying like, God, I just want to represent you well. I don't want to be a hypocrite Christian. I want you to like be inside me where I represent Come you on. well and I make you proud. Come on. And he said to do that, you're gonna have to take on repentance. And I said, for what? And he said, I want you to say sorry for all the Christians that abused, that hurt you. And I heard him say, speak to the people and say, I'm sorry. Wow. For the Christians that hurt you, that abused you. They used you. That wow. didn't represent my Christ, my God, my Christ. <laughs> that didn't take the name well. Wow. Wow. Come on, extend your hands. Father, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you, Lord God. Father, you're doing heart surgery right now. Lord, Father, there's a circumcision of heart. There's a heart change. Come on, somebody, raise your hand. There's a heart change coming into the body of Christ. And God is making things right in this hour. Come on, give the Lord a hand. Stephanie, why do you want to be baptized today? Um, I honestly just, you know, today I came to watch everybody and enjoy and just you know, encourage everybody and just be in the presence of God when all this is happening. But I, I was sitting here thinking that um, I need a breakthrough in a lot of ways, but I, I, Come on. I'm in a new phase of my life completely. I, in the last um, eight years, I, I, my life completely changed. I have a new name. I have a new purpose and I have, uh, but so many things are hanging on to me from the past. Yeah. I realized today, I remember before when we had done a teaching and we talked about when the Israelites went through the Red Sea, yeah, they looked back on the other side and they say all their enemies dead on the seashore. Yes. And I feel like I still have some of those enemies that are hounding me, hounding me, hounding me, and I just can't seem to shake them. And so I'm, I'm shaking them today in the water. Of Come on, yeah. And, yeah. Um, and I... I want to just make a declaration too that I'm going to serve the Lord even in government where I know it's really hard, but I come want on. to represent the Lord and the kingdom of God and the truth of God yeah, come in on. our government. Woo, come on. Mark, a point of transition. Jordan, why do you want to be baptized today? I got, uh, I got baptized when I was probably 10 and uh, it didn't mean anything. Um, and I really wanted to mean something. I just wanted to declare my faith to God and just, just uh, basically just renew my relationship with Him and just to, just. Yeah, come on. Renewed relationship, yeah. Come on. Yeah. Good job, Jordan. Hannah, why do you want to be baptized today? Wow. So on Wednesday, I was just thinking about how our church services are so, like we have pretty organized church services. And I just felt the Holy Spirit saying like, I'm just gonna start leading each service. It's yeah. not gonna be led by a leader, <laughs> a human leader anymore. Yay. It's gonna be led by me. 
and I'm also going to start leading your life in that way. Come on, yeah, yeah. Like, I can feel him all around me all the time, anytime I need him now. And I can feel that the call on my life and on my marriage is so much more than anything we can accomplish alone. Come on, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I almost chickened out right before this. I'm like, that's exactly what Satan wants us to do. So this is a breakthrough, this is a breakthrough point. Awesome, come on, breakthrough. Come on everybody, for breakthrough. All right, pastors, we got Scott ready. Pastor Steve, get ready over there. I'll be over there in just a moment. Help these uh, get in right. And this is what I want us to do. I want you all to stand up right now. Come on, let's all stand up. We're gonna worship. We're gonna put, let's shut this down and we're gonna keep moving forward and we're gonna worship. Now, two things that we need. I said earlier at the start of this service, we need help in children. 60% of our church is not back yet, and uh, most of them were all our children. So if you will have in your heart, if the Holy Spirit would have you to help just one time a month, we need you to sign up on that back table. Anybody, one time a month, that's all we need, is one time a month. What, if we all do a little bit, nobody has to do a lot. So please, yeah, come on somebody, yeah. We need your help right now. We'll need help for Wednesday and next weekend. So if the Lord is putting it on your heart, there's two um, sign up sheets that say volunteer. Just flip it up and write your name down there and write behind it, kids, okay? Now, this is what we do as a family. We do this. We bring in the seed and the offering and the tithe and everything that the Lord gives. What we want to do is you get ready to worship. Jesse, you're back up there. Good turnaround. Come on, give it up to Jesse. Good job. Do you feel different, Jesse? Come on. Your heart clean. Come on, somebody. We're going to worship the Lord, and we need all the help financially that we can get. You have been absolutely faithful. We thank you at home. Those of you who are watching at home, thank you very much. You can go to 530, bridge530.com, hit the donate button. We appreciate it. God is doing miracles down here through the building, through everything that's happening. And we're getting ready for harvest. Come on, somebody. We're getting ready for harvest. <laughs> so you can come to the wheelbarrows. Please put your inf uh, information on one of the envelopes. And there are two stations in the back. If you have your handbook, Bring it out real quick. Lord, in the name of Jesus, Father, we bless every checkbook, every job, every student, every employer, every business. We bless it in Jesus' mighty name. Lord, whoever we would bless, you would bless. So we bless them right now in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you for the tithe. Thank you for the offering. And thank you for the seed that you provide. We receive it now in Jesus' mighty name. And everyone said, amen. Give somebody a high five and we're gonna baptize some more. Let's worship the King of Kings. Father, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Your desire to be one with Him and to live in freedom. Jesus' name. Whoa! Hey! Thank you, Lord. Whoa! <laughs> All right, come on. Come on, Dom. Help him up. Love you, brother. Love you, man. For me.
revival. Call a revival, the call of repentance. Oh, come, Lord, to you today. I will fill your heart, says the Lord. I will open your mouth, and I shall release a fresh wave of repentance into my body, and I will release revival, says the Lord. I open your mouth this day to prophesy, my daughter. God of the brain. Come on, let's worship the Lord. Possible. Oh, all things are possible. Show me one thing you can't do. Show me one thing you can't do. He's the God wow. of the brain. Come on, clap for the Lord. We have never done one of these services that others didn't add on to the list. Now, again, I want to thank everybody at home, and we thank you for being with us today. You are loved, and you are missed, and we thank you very much. We are uh, keeping your spot ready for you. When you're ready to come on out, your place is right here. We're at 1104 J Street, Marysville. We thank you very much. We bless you in Jesus' name. I bless Texas and Oregon and all over the country that are watching. We thank you. Come on, give my hand. We bless. We thank you for all the support, the financial support, all the prayer support, and we thank you all in Jesus' name. Have a wonderful day. Be blessed. The Lord is good. Come on, somebody said he does miracles in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a wonderful day. In Jesus' name. If you haven't signed up, please give us a hand. We need help. Blessing in Jesus' name. Show me what else you can't find. He's the God.